Hi, I'm Lalit Vasist and you're watching Engineering Made Easy. And the problem that we are going to discuss in this video is based on antenna current in case of amplitude modulation. As we know that in amplitude modulation, the amplitude of the carrier wave is varied according to the instantaneous value of the modulating signal. Modulating signal is also known as the message signal. While in case of a frequency and phase modulation, the carrier wave's frequency or phase is changed according to the variations in the instantaneous value of the modulating signal. So this problem is related to the amplitude modulation and uh, here it states that the antenna current of an AM transmitter is 8 ampere if only the carrier is sent. So the antenna current in case of when the carrier is sent is 8 ampere. But when we modulate it by a modulating signal single sinusoidal wave when we modulate it by a sinusoidal wave then this antenna current increases to 8.93 amperes there is an increase after modulation of the carrier wave so I want to find here the percent modulation this is the first part of this problem the second part is also find the antenna current if the percent of modulation changes to 80 percent so in this case I have been given the antenna current of the carrier wave before modulation and after modulation the antenna current is also given and I want to find the percent modulation for this modulation amplitude modulation and the second part of this equation states that uh, if the mo percent of modulation changes to 80 percent in that case you again find the antenna current what will be its value so this question was asked in UP tech semester exams 2004 and 5 so let's discuss it as we know that uh, this is the standard formula of um, power in case of amplitude modulation ma means the modulation index for amplitude a small a i have uh, denoted it for amplitude modulation so power total is equal to power of the carrier 1 plus ma square by 2 it is for power but here we are dealing with the current the antenna current so i need to change it to current format this formula okay so power total I can uh, take it uh, to the left side so it becomes power total by power carrier it becomes equal to 1 plus ma square by 2 and I know that uh, power is equal to i square r this is the basic formula power power is equal to i square r r is the resistance i is the current so pt will be i t square into r and uh, pc will be i c square r c and t r as it is so R, R cancels out and I have IT by IC equals to under root of 1 plus MA square by 2. So this is the formula. Take this IC to the right side in multiplication. So IT becomes IT is equals to IC square root of 1 plus MA square by 2. This is the formula that we will use to solve this problem. Here I want to find the M, the modulation index and uh, I have been given this IT and IC. IC is 8 ampere. This is the antenna current before modulation and IT is the antenna current that that is increased to 8.93 after modulation of this carrier wave. So IT, IC are given. I can simply calculate this M. Okay, MA. So 8.93 arrange the put these values in the equation it 8.93 equals to ic is 8 under root 1 plus ma square by 2 on solving i get 1 plus ma square by 2 equals to 8.93 by 8 so ma square by 2 becomes equal to this you can calculate it simply you can see these steps okay so ma comes out to be equals to 0 0.701 this is the modulation index for amplitude modulation and to calculate the percent modulation I just multiply it by 100 so percent modulation will be 70.1 percent okay now let's come to the second part of this uh, problem it states that if the percent modulation changes to 80 percent then what will be the total current antenna current okay I will put the values IT I want to calculate and IC I have been given the old value that is the 8 uh, amperes 
under root of 1 plus now the percent modulation is 80 percent so the modulation index will be divided by 100 so it will be 0 0.8 okay modulation index is obtained by dividing by 100 the uh, percent modulation so it is 0 0.8 so 0 0.8 square by 2 so i will get the total antenna current after modulation for this uh, 0.8 modulation index so it is equal to 9.19 amperes so this was very interesting problem related to antenna current in case of amplitude modulation in next videos i will upload more videos uh, based on uh, engineering problems and also related to this topic so keep watching engineering made easy and for more such videos you can subscribe my channel engineering made easy and please don't forget to like and share the video if you liked it so see you guys in the next video till then bye bye friends for more such videos you can uh, subscribe my channel engineering made easy and please don't forget to like and share the video if you liked it for more detailed information you can uh, visit my blog see you soon in the next video till then bye bye